change the world if I could, I would try and make peace with other countries who we're currently fighting with. Um, I believe changing the world starts with the children because like they're the next generation. And I think before changing the world, we have to start here and change America. Um, we want to recycle more and get everyone else in the whole world to recycle more to save the planet. I want to change the world by recycling more. I would want to introduce everyone to music because music is something that I find is a great way to express myself and just express how I feel to other people as well. I want to change the world by making it a better place by cleaning up the parks and helping the children. Leading by example, by thinking of others before myself, um, really? expanding <laughs> our horizons, creating greater education opportunities, creating jobs, for, for, for jobs <laughs> creating greater education opportunities for children in the world. If I could do anything to change the world, I'd educate the world. I think one of the biggest problems in the world is lack of education. Baldwin helps me do this by valuing education. Um, I never realized how blessed I really am to be able to go to such a beautiful school with such a great education. Baldwin helps me because uh, like, I make a lot of friends, like new friends, there. everyone's really diverse, I guess, and um, you meet a lot of people from different cultures and you can appreciate everything that they do. Baldwin helps me realize that um, people are different, but it's okay, and you need to really respect their differences. Um, well, they teach me like life skills and how to be confident to put my word out there. Oh, they teach us that setting goals is a good thing to do and that you can achieve them with hard work. Giving me the confidence that I need to know that I can do whatever I want, I can do whatever I set my mind to. Because like everyone is so warm and welcoming and accepting and like it's, Baldwin is just a really nice place. Who or what inspires you? Sydney? People that encourage you to do your best and keep working. Hearing other people who are really talented or even not talented but trying hard. It inspires me seeing like other people doing good for each other because it's such a beautiful thing to see and it makes me want to do that too. My teachers inspire me. Um, well, my teachers inspire me because they're really nice role models. What inspires me is waking up every morning and seeing my mom's face and Miss Powell's face. I guess the fact that I'm getting this education, that I am given this opportunity, inspires me to do better with my life, you know, to work harder so that I can do the best that I can do because I know not very many people get this opportunity. My teachers and my parents and people who have helped me along the way, I think that when they look back and see, or when they look forward and see what I've done, it inspires me to think of that. Well, Baldwin inspires me because they're always teaching me new things and new lessons. Okay, well, Gabby Douglas inspires me because she's a really good gymnast and I really want to be like her. I think my, oh, that's a pretty good question and I think my mother is the most inspired person in the world because she, like, said, give me permission to go to America so I can make my dream come true. Uh, I would like to become a diplomat so that I can connect people around the world and help them understand each other. When I go out, I want to be a police officer like my mom. And they're really cool because they save people, they help people. I want to be a pediatrician when I grow up. <laughs> so, because I love kids and I love helping people. I want to be a linguist um, and also a doctor. So, and also a dermatologist, just a lot of little things. But I just want to be a traveler as well. I just want to be a compassionate person. I want to be successful. I want to be an architect. Um, when I grow up, I want to be a writer. I'd like to win an Oscar. I'd like to win a MacArthur grant. I want to be a scientist, a explorer, an inventor, or a vet. <laughs> what do you want to be when you grow up? Hannah, a research scientist. Nia, a lawyer. Hannah, interior designer. Jasmine, an orthopedic surgeon. Eliza, a doctor. Ariana, a judge on Cupcake Wars. <laughs> I want to become somebody who thinks of ideas that can make an impact on other people and somebody whose words really change things. When I grow up, I want to be a vet. I want to be a lawyer or somebody who can find a cure for cancer.
and one of the be a president and a doctor. I just want to be something that helps someone out when I'm older. Like as long as I'm helping people, that's fine. When I grow up, I want to be a doctor like my mom because it's important and what she does is she helps doctors work for, like, work for the heart and she teaches them how to do it in case somebody's heart goes wrong. I don't know. The world is mine, right? I could be anything, right? I guess I'll figure it out one day.